Girl, tell us how you're smiling. Well, I'm smiling. Yeah. I'm smiling. You know, it's just been a journey all from freshman year to this year. And freshman year, I didn't make it at all in the 800, and I knew I was capable of. So just putting in the work and trusting what Coach had for me, and like trusting God and everything, just to come here and win it the next year. It's just amazing. So amazing. So what would you tell people who are going through pretty rough journeys um, that are that want to be in a position like yours? I would say stay patient. You know. Your coaches do know what they're doing. Communicate and just give your best because that's enough. If you're here running track and field and you got a passion for it, just grind deep and find within yourself to uh, perform well. You mentioned like not making it last year. What do you think made the difference um, heading into like this season and today? Um, honestly, my spiritual um, growth—it's it, been a journey. Honestly, I've learned so much. I've gotten so much closer to God and just. Stepping to the line with a deeper purpose, you know, trusting that what he's putting me is enough. And also, like, during cross country, your coaches put me in longer races. I did the 6K, that dreaded thing. <laughs> so I feel like, you know, having more stamina for the end of my races has been a huge difference because if you watch a lot of my races last year, I just didn't have it. Talk about the game plan. Almost two days ago, you wanted to collegiate your record, but it was really windy. So it looked like you just still went for it. I mean, what was the oh, process? Yeah, I definitely went for it. The start of the race, I, I wasn't told anything about the wind, but I just shoved it to the back of my head and said, I'm going to keep it pushing because I know what I'm capable of doing. Uh, came through the 800, it's like 58 high, a little slower, slower than I wanted, but you know, I was just like, I'm going to still surge here because that was the game plan. And then it came to 200 meters ago, I was like 128 high, 129, and I was like, still gonna finish because it's still championship race so I'll always have another chance hopefully to get the collegiate record but today wasn't the day it was just one time. Were you worried with 100 to go because they were pretty close but it's <laughs> like you guys all sort of slowed up at the same pace. Um I had told myself to like not look back because you know I wanted to give everything any millisecond looking back could have cost me so I was just like I saw on the billboard where they were and I was like I still have something in me I'm just gonna go to my form and push through the line. You talked about a game plan to push right at, right at after 400 is that right because it, it looked like you dropped Rosina right after. 